Hey, this is Stacia, and we're going to do something a little different. We're going to play a blitz game. <laughs> um, I need to get better at playing under pressure and staying focused. So we're going to do this. I'll try to commentate the best I can, but I'm really out to win this game. Let's see who we get. Okay, we got a 1673. Perfect. I'll go E4. It's a Khan. Okay, I'm going to go Pan of Attack. Let's develop with Knight C3. Okay, they're playing Theory. Takes and Queen B3. Yep, Queen B3. If they take here, I'm just going to take, so I'll pre-move it. See what they do from here. Might be six is a move, I think. E6. Actually, E6 is important, isn't it? Because like we're threatening to win that knight. Knight B6 like stops that. But against that, I'm gonna go D5. Wow, they did that. I think that loses though. Why can't I just take your knight? Seems like this is good for me. I like this. You fork me, I fork you. Everybody forks everyone. Can I go king d1? That's a question. King d1 takes check. Yeah, their king also has to go the d file. So this seems okay to me. Then their knight will be trapped. I'm just up a piece, right? Do you believe I'm up a piece? Okay, and we've only used 12 seconds. Okay, uh, my students will approve. <laughs> they pick on me for not being quick. I don't blame them. I want them to pick on me for not being quick. Um, okay, what am I doing? Let's go here. I'm going to take that, and if they move it, I'm going to do, okay, so I did that one. That makes sense. Now I could take, take, check, but, okay, I'm actually going to go here. I'm taking away the square. I want to play king e2 and collect the knight on a1. They resigned. Okay, let's go. <laughs> So I can play Blitz. Okay, let's analyze it just for fun. Um, but I think I played fairly well. Wow, I played 92.7. That's like better than my real games. But I had some kind of miss. What was the miss? I don't know what the miss was. Let's find out. Okay, this is all theory. I think that... Yeah, I thought this move was a blunder, and it is a blunder. But I didn't even play the best move. There's bishop b5 check. So this is the miss. I should go here. Okay, I want to turn everything off for a second. Because I just want to analyze it ourselves. Okay, if we go check, they can take. But guess what? We still want a piece that way, too. Okay, well, I didn't even consider that. I just saw a free piece. I'm like, let's take a free piece. I did at least calculate everyone forking everything. But if they had, if we did this, yeah, they're forced to put the king in front or take, so, or queen. So they have to take, basically, right? And then we would take with check, and they would have to do this, and then I take here. Now this should be good because we're just up a piece. Yeah, this is in fact it. And then here, here was still threatening a fork. So they have to go rook d8. And then we probably just move our knight and that's it. Yep, just knight c3 and we're just up material and winning. Okay, so I learned that. I didn't, I, I mean, I didn't know about that, but winning a piece seems good. So, you know, I'm not too upset about my decision to take that. It is plus two.
So it did win a piece. Take, take here, check here. So I calculated this right. I thought King D1 is good. It is good. Yeah, because their king also has no choice but to come to the D file. Now, if that king didn't come to the D file and they could play check and stuff, like that's a problem. But that's not the case here. Well, I was going to win that rook anyway. <laughs> so it doesn't really... Not sure what I was thinking, honestly. Yeah, and they did that. And then they decided to resign because we're just up a piece. So I hope you guys enjoyed this quick little video and I'll be back with more. Okay.